Okay, so first of all, it's maybe it's a, we have it's a enough social distance. So I'm gonna take off my mask. Hi, today it's uh, one in nine. <laughs> my name is Takashi Kudo from Team Labs. Team Labs is uh, we founded on 2001, and uh, it's art collectives represented by the Pace Galleries, and it's try to create some things, very weird stuff using of its uh, digital technologies. And the Team Labs is, it's quite weird organizations. Like uh, we are hardware engineer, software engineers, and uh, mathematicians, and uh, like musicians, and CG animators, and architect. And we make a teams and it's create some output together. And we called co-creations. And that is, you know, uh, team labs. First of all, uh, we are not, it's a political artist and it's, you know, we are not bound by it, like nationalities and stuff. And it's what we, our aims is just, it's, you know, try to find the new relationship between the human and the natures or its world, including of these other human beings. And as we try to expand it in our visions, using of these digital technologies. And it's, but this digital technology is just only tools and these materials for us. It's of course, there it's a core part of this in our output though. And it's, uh, we using it uh, digital technologies. So this is a uh, natural to be, it's uh, no boundaries. I try to explain a little bit more. Uh, inside of it's our mind, there is, so many ideas. Maybe you also have many ideas, concepts, and creativities. And they are affected each other. And they are exist in the same times. And there's no boundary inside of its own mind. But when we try to explain something in this physical world, that before we needed to use some physical materials. And we are not against this anything, so it's you know, like, we are not against with it's a traditional art or it's a fine art or whatever our other people's like art activities. But it's when technically it's when you explain something using of this physical materials, like for example, like islands or whatever, it's gonna be fixed. And it's making a boundary between it and the artworks and us. Because of the channel, uh, we cannot be inside of the channel the artworks, but uh, the digital and the technology is free from that. That is, you know, most biggest it's uh, evolutions for us at least. And it's for us as uh, we wanted to explain in you know, something we think in a beautiful, and that it's not possible to explain it in other way. At least it's you know, for us. We try to bring the people to be inside with it in our installations. So. There is no boundary between its uh, visitors and the human and artworks. And as we believe it's, you know, like in the boundaries, it's something that's illusion, just human made. Please visit our exhibitions and try to be here. And as for example, you can change all this, you know, all the, change the world by yourself and uh, you're gonna be, one part of it's in our installations and that's by physical bodies. What is art? And it's a, we don't know it's in our output is art or not. And it's not, it's gonna be decided on in the histories. So it's maybe after 20 years or after 30 years, or maybe in the forever it's, we don't know. If our output could influence to the peoples and it's a, if they could change the world, maybe later it's people wanna call it in our output as art. And it's now what is art is for me is at least it's, it's questions. What we can do is just keep on making the question to the world. We really don't know it's you know like <laughs> what is the answers because it's uh, we are just keep on making questions. And it's our question is the borderless world is beautiful and don't you think so? <laughs>